the complete working of an internal combustion engine, explained like never before. Ever wondered what happens under the hood when you turn the key or push the start button in your car? That smooth purr or loud growl from the engine is far more than just noise. It's a mechanical symphony, a brilliant feat of engineering that's powered civilization for over a century. Welcome to the fascinating world of the Internal Combustion Engine, ICE, a genius invention that converts tiny explosions into the roaring force that moves vehicles, powers generators, and shapes modern life. Buckle up, because we're going deep inside the beating heart of your car, one piston stroke at a time. What is an internal combustion engine? At its core, an internal combustion engine is a heat engine. It converts chemical energy from fuel to mechanical energy through controlled explosions, combustion, that occur inside the engine itself. This sets it apart from external combustion engines like steam engines, where the burning takes place outside the working chamber. This engine doesn't just run, it breathes, compresses, explodes, and exhales in a perfect rhythm. The brain behind the brawn, basic components. Before we jump into the action, let's meet the key players inside this mechanical marvel. Cylinder, the chamber where all the action takes place. Piston, a cylindrical piece that moves up and down inside the cylinder. Connecting rod, connects the piston to the crankshaft. Crankshaft, converts up and down motion into rotary motion to move your wheels. Camshaft, operates the intake and exhaust valves. Valves, control the flow of air-fuel mixture and exhaust gases. Spark plug, ignites the air-fuel mixture in petrol engines. Fuel injector, or carburetor, delivers fuel into the combustory chamber. Timing belt or chain, synchronizes the movement of crankshaft and camshaft. Now that we know the team, let's see them in action. The four-stroke cycle, the engine's pulse. Most internal combustion engines use a four-stroke cycle, an elegant and precisely timed dance of air, fuel, pressure, and fire. One, intake stroke, the breath of life. The piston moves downward, creating a vacuum that opens the intake valve. A mixture of air and fuel is sucked into the cylinder. This is the engine breathing in. It's like the engine is taking a deep breath before delivering a mighty punch. Two, compression stroke, building the pressure. The piston now moves upward, compressing the air-fuel mixture. This increases its density and makes it more explosive. The intake and exhaust valves are closed. The mixture is now a tightly packed, highly volatile charge. This is where tension builds, like pulling back a slingshot. Three, power stroke, the big bang. At the peak of compression, the spark plug fires in petrol engines, igniting the mixture. A mini explosion occurs, forcing the piston downward with incredible force. This is the stroke that generates the power to turn the crankshaft and ultimately your wheels. It's like the engine's heart-pounding climax, a controlled burst of energy that screams, go. Four, exhaust stroke, time to exhale. After the power stroke, the exhaust valve opens and the piston moves back up, pushing burnt gases out of the cylinder through the exhaust system. Just like a marathon runner, the engine exhales the waste and prepares for another breath. And then the cycle repeats, over thousands of times per minute in a single cylinder. Multiply that by four, six, or eight cylinders, and you begin to realize the symphony of speed happening under the hood. How this all turns into motion. So how does a piston's up and down movement actually move your car? The answer lies in the crankshaft. As the piston is pushed down during the power stroke, it turns the crankshaft, which is connected to the transmission system. This transmission sends the rotary force, torque, to the wheels, or, well, causing your car to move forward. Not really a T or waiting for a red light or cruising on a highway. Take a moment to appreciate what's happening beneath your feet. A perfectly tuned orchestra of metal, fire, fuel, and motion is working tirelessly to get you where you need to go. The internal combustion engine isn't just a machine. 
It's a masterpiece, a loud, hot, thrilling reminder of how far curiosity and innovation can take us. And that, my friend, is the complete, thrilling story of how an internal combustion engine works.